About a year ago, I converted my RC chuck glider to the Express LRS receiver. This time, I'm going to update the receiver to version 3.3, .3, so stay tuned to find out more. <laughs> Welcome there everyone. So, this is the EPW5 and this was released somewhat about a year ago and I've used this for my previous videos in the uh, chuck glider conversion video as well as the FPV wing video and I haven't flown it in a while since I've updated my radio to the version 3 for Express LRS. So I felt that it's time to update this to the version 3. Do note that this is also the same process with the EPW6. So the receiver had the version 2 firmware, um, 2 point something something, I don't really remember which one. And uh, my radio is on version 3 Express LRS. So what we're going to do is we're going to update the receiver to version 3.3.0 which is the current latest version of the Express LRS receiver. So if your receiver is not bound or if you don't have your radio turned on then you will have this slow flashing from the receiver itself and if it goes into Wi-Fi mode it's going to be flashing rapidly. If it has a solid green light there is a high chance that there may be a wrong firmware installed on it and you may have to reflash the receiver. There are many versions of the Express LRS PWM receiver which you can get. There's of course Beta FPV, Matex Systems, Holy Bro, and Radio Master. So these are the few that you can get but the one I have is the EPW5. Generally all the updates are gonna be the same. It's just made by a different manufacturer. So the simplest way to get this done is to open up your Express LRS configurator. If you don't have one, go get one and download the latest version which is version 1.6 then you're gonna go and look for the device category and that would be the manufacturer and the device itself uh, which model of the Express LRS receiver that you are using what we're gonna do is we're gonna choose the flashing method and we're gonna choose Wi-Fi make sure you have your binding phrase set up all done and the performance option I'm gonna put lock on first connection I'm gonna set that to on after which we are going to click on build. Once you have your file, you're going to put that file in the desktop or wherever convenient where you can easily find them. And you're going to use this file to update the firmware of the receiver. Now we're going to put our receiver into Wi-Fi mode and I'm just going to plug it in without having the radio turned on so that it will force it into Wi-Fi mode. It shouldn't take too long and once it goes into rapid flashing and you know that it is in Wi-Fi mode. Then we are going to connect the computer to the receiver and we're going to use the Wi-Fi mode. Check your Wi-Fi for Express LRS RX and that will be the one that you should connect to. And once connected, you will it will bring you into this menu. Then we're going to Take that file that we downloaded earlier and put it into choose file and click update. So once the update is done, you're good to go. Now upon connection, it's still going to be flashing slowly. So just give it some time for the receiver to communicate with the radio. But just in case, open up your Express LRS Lua script on your radio and check that it has the model mismatch warning that comes out. If it does, go to your model mismatch and turn it on and turn it off. Then your radio should connect to your receiver almost immediately. Sometimes we may have messed certain settings, so not all channels are correct so in this sense I had a previous EPW5 that was set to channel 5 for throttle but this one is set to channel 1 so you just want to make sure that you plug and test which which channel is the one for throttle and which are the ones for your servos for your planes or your RC car and RC boat right looks like the receiver is in order I hope you guys have a great time with the EPW5 receivers and if you have any questions please feel free to drop into the comment section down below. So that's it for today's video. Thank you all for watching and see you guys again soon. Ciao!